today's learning target is, I can tell if a word is a proper noun or a common noun. Nouns can be words that are people, like this person. We could use the noun boy, or Mike, or brother, or girl, or Julie, or daughter. Those are nouns too. Names of animals can be nouns too, like lizard, or gecko, or leo. Places can be nouns too, like city, or building, or New York. The names of things can be nouns also, like Rocky Road, or cone, or ice cream. Well, believe it or not, there are two kinds of nouns, common nouns and proper nouns. So, let me tell you the difference. Listen carefully, there will be a quiz. Let's start with proper nouns. Proper nouns refer to specific people, animals, places, or things. When somebody asks what your name is, they're asking for a proper noun. The proper name for this animal is Bella. The proper name for this drink is Heritage Coffee. The proper name of this toy is Legos. The proper name of this place is Seattle, Washington. The proper name of this glacier is the Mendenhall Glacier. I want you to notice that when we write down proper names, we always give them capitals at the beginning. The thing about proper nouns is they refer to one-of-a-kind things, like Abraham Lincoln. They are special, so they deserve the honor of the capital letter. Now you try. I'm going to put up pictures of things that are proper nouns. You tell me what you think the noun is that I'm thinking of. Did you say Juneau, Alaska? Notice that when I wrote it, I have a capital J for Juneau and a capital A for Alaska. Did you say Captain Underpants? Notice I've capitalized the C and the U. This is a proper noun. Did you say Disneyland? Notice I've capitalized the D. I bet you got this one. It's Sawyer. And I capitalize the S in his name, just like you should every time you write your name down. Are you ready for a challenge? This is a famous mountain in Alaska. Do you know the proper name for it? If you said Mount Denali, then you are correct. We've just practiced proper nouns. Now it's time to practice common nouns. A common noun is a word for something that is commonly found. It's not a specific thing, it's a very generic word. Like this pumpkin. There are millions of pumpkins around the world, and unless somebody has a pet pumpkin named Peter, this is a common noun. It's just a pumpkin. So we would write the word with a lowercase p. There are several nouns we could use here. We could call them kids because we don't know their names, or baseball players, or friends, or a team. All of those are nouns. If we use the word kids, then we would write it with a lowercase k because it is a common noun. What nouns do you see in this picture? Do you see road, or houses, or village? And this is a village. We don't know its name, so we would just write village. I'll bet you'll get this one. The common noun is pencils. 
Now you try. I'm going to put up pictures of things that are proper nouns. You tell me what you think the noun is that I'm thinking of. The common nouns you might have used here are fireman, fire, helmet, oxygen tank, wood, and there are probably some others. You wouldn't say the word Bob because we don't know this fireman's name, and that would be a proper noun. What common nouns do you see here? Maybe you said trees or forest, green, pines, there are probably lots more. Name some common nouns here. Did you say island or beach, trees, ocean, water? We wouldn't name this island because those would be proper nouns. Let's play a game. I'm going to show you a word in the middle of the screen and you tell me if you think it's proper or common. See if you can do it before I say the answer. Here we go. The noun is Joey. Is it proper or common? If you said it was a proper noun, you win a point. The word is classroom. If you said this was a common noun, you win a point. The word is unicorn. If you said it was a common noun, you win a point. The word is Fred Meyer. If you said this was a proper noun, then you win a point. If you got all four of those correct, then you're doing great. If you need some extra practice, play this game with a friend. Just ask for help. Today's learning target was, I can tell if a word is a proper noun or a common noun. Can you? If not, watch this video again and see if you can figure it out.